When we see an object, the eye captures the image for a fragment of a second after the object disappears. The object leaves a transient memory on the retina. When the eye sees a rapid sliding of still images, the images are linked together on the eye and the memory. This is the basic principle of animation. When we talk in the urban space, we keep a collection of events and narratives superimposed into our body. The zoetrope or the wheel of life was invented by William Horner in 1834 as an optical instrument and an educational toy. Based on the persistence of vision, the zoetrope is one of the peripheral tools of early cinema. The zoetrope is a three-dimensional and horizontally arranged wheel drum with a strip of images placed in its circumference. When rotated, behind a second fenestrated disc can spun, the images drawn on the wheel blend together to give an illusion of a continuous movement. The Zoltrop departs from the camera obscura in the sense that it embeds the observer and the environment into a haptic surface. Rather than fixing the eye as the camera obscura does, the Zoltrop animates the close relationship between the observer and the nature of the event. Through touch, the observer engages with the specificity of the environment that is captured in the machine and through the machine. Revolving the Zoltrop device goes beyond displaying a continuous movement of sequential images. The Zoltrop creates a memory. Script writing, storyboarding, camera movement, framing and editing related to how you capture different urban relations that you observe. Capturing stickless street through a device reproducing urban narrative in the different fragments. Experiencing architecture is linked with the state of a being an observer and being observed.